That is why we're here. We're here for one another. We're here to stand shoulder to shoulder with each other. We're here because we're a community. And that's what a community does. We fight for each other. We stand up for each other. And everything that you do matters. We are your teachers, we are your students, we are your brothers and sisters. And we are integrated into every aspect of the city and our surrounding cities and beyond. When people say that this country was built on slavery and genocide, it tends to be something that you hear and you throw away, but don't throw it away. Grab onto it and really think about what that means. Because, because, a fascist grief that's making you all scared and I'm glad that it's making you scared I'm happy to see your fear because the same thing has been happening to people and they've been having to live under it since the inception of this country this land doesn't belong to the United States of America <laughs> and he said and I quote anger Anger in the face of great injustice is an appropriate response. But our task, our task is to harness that anger, to harness that energy in that disciplined manner that brings forward the outcome that we want to bring your bodies, to bring your tender bodies as tinder, to bring your tender bodies as tinder to this fire of justice. Shut the tension camps now! Shut them down! Shut the camps now! 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 Shut the camps now. But calling for the shutdown of these facilities, of these concentration camps, is not that easy. You may feel a little bit like, when is this going to end? When will happy ever after come? How much more do we have to do? But it's not just now that families are separated. It's not just recently. We don't even know how many people have actually died in attempts to cross the border, but we are going to say the names of those who we know have died most recently. Darling Cristabel Cordova Valle, 10 years old, from El Salvador. Presente. From Guatemala, 16 years of age, Carlos Gregorio Hernandez. From Guatemala, two years of age, Wilmer Josué Ramirez Vázquez. From Guatemala, 16 years of age, Juan de Leon Gutierrez. From Guatemala, 8 years of age, Felipe 
Gomez Alonso. From Guatemala, seven years of age, Jacqueline Cal. While crossing the Rio Grande River from El Salvador, Father Oscar Alberto Martinez Ramirez, 23 years of age, and his daughter Angie Valeria. And for all of those who we do not know the names 